Welcome to Behind the Adventure, Episode 5, for the highly anticipated Jersey Devil Coaster, the world's tallest, fastest, and longest single rail coaster, opening in 2021 at Six Flags Great Adventure. Since work resumed December 28th, it feels like track installation has been in hyperdrive. We have so much to talk about. But before we get started, we'd like to point out a few tricks of the trade that our team has used to combat winter weather to keep the devil in tip-top shape. As temperatures were dropping last fall, crews took on the task of repositioning all of the track pieces that had yet to be installed. The track is designed with holes to allow for water runoff after installation. But prior to installation, Given all of the curves, the pieces would surely hold water, which could then freeze as temperatures plunged. Ice would present a variety of challenges, from slipping during installation to additional weight for the crane, but particularly warping. All pieces were repositioned to allow rainwater to run off the steel naturally. Secondly, crews added thick lubricant to all of the anchor bolts to help prevent rusting. Columns go through minor adjustments as the track is being installed, and the anchor bolts will be torqued once the track has been completed. Until that time, these bolts need to move freely without becoming corroded. Now, let's go over the fence and check out the latest construction news. From January 3rd through 6th, workers completed the overbanked turn near Congo Rapids. When both rides are running, there's going to be exciting new views from both locations. The crew then installed three airtime hills that comprise the finale of Jersey Devil Coaster. Sometimes shims are needed to get the track into the perfect position. January 12th was a particularly productive day, with a record five pieces of track being installed and crane repositioning. Oh, that music means it's time for everyone's second favorite game show. Name, Name that part. part. Mike the Foreman is moving some small but very important parts. What are they called? Let's see if you can name that part. Is it A, a saddle, B, a socket? or C, a saucer. Can you name that part? The correct answer is A, a saddle. If you answered correctly, JD, tell them what they've won. Excellent, congratulations, I think. And now back to construction. On January 13th, brake run and catwalk installation began. You can see the T-bars that will hold the catwalks and safety netting in place. The wooden boxes on top of the track are protecting the magnetic brakes during installation. These brakes will slow the train as it approaches the station. In preparation for work to resume on the maintenance building and loading station, the team moved three roof supports. On January 14th, the final brake run was completed and work on the maintenance and loading areas resumed. Thank you. 
In our next video, we'll showcase the completion of track installation, which includes the lift hill and first drop, and that pivotal moment in a construction project, the topping off. If you liked this video, please let us know and share it. Check out our weekly construction updates on Twitter and Instagram stories. Thank you for watching and for your continued support of Six Flags Great Adventure. Thank you.